I swear, man, some of these Xbox dudes in this damn community is downright embarrassing. Like, we don't, we don't freaking claim those people. Like, they are some fucking retards in this community, and that's, that's the reason why I don't support a lot of these Xbox Pro channels, because they are more of a console war channel than actually an Xbox channel or a gaming channel in general. They so focus on the downfall of Sony or Nintendo, but they're not concentrating on basically, you know, just talking about how much fun that they are having with their games. They're more about about the death or the death of the other gaming console. It's, it's so fucking stupid. So <clears throat> I went to a game spot and they basically had an article about some person, uh, Wrath93. I believe he has a YouTube channel. I believe he does. <clears throat> uh, basically, he um, he came out and he basically said this to Phil Spencer because Phil Spencer, he... Uh, you know, we already know the Phil Spencer. He uh, he's a nice guy. He he praises Nintendo. He praises Sony. So he give credit when credit is due. So basically, he was on Twitter and he <clears throat> basically uh, said that one of his most anticipated games is Uncharted 4. And uh, <clears throat> of course, it's a game made by the competitors, you know, Sony. And I guess that did not take well with some of these uh, Xbox dudes. And you know, <laughs> this guy Wrath 93, whatever he calls himself, he basically saying. The head of Xbox talking about how great, you know, Uncharted 4 will be. Just wave the white flag already. This is embarrassing. Sad to say. Like, <laughs> God dang. Like, seriously. Come on, man. And Phil Spence, he came back with, uh, he, he got him back. And he replied back to him. And he said that we should all reply. I mean, I'm, I'm sorry. We should all applaud when the team does something special. Those who uh, those who hope for the team to fail due to the platform aren't real gamers. That's basically what he just said. So basically, he just said him, you know, put him in his place and shit. And this is what we go through on a daily basis. Like, uh, you know, a lot of these ex uh, box guys in this community is just it's fucking embarrassing as hell to even want to you know socialize with those types of people. Like, you know, Uncharted Four is a game that I want to play. You know, it looks really good. I, you know, it's, it's <laughs> action adventure games is what I love to play. You know, uh, uh, Rise of Tomb Raider was a great game, and and on Chapter Four, uh, it looks like a game that's similar to Tomb Raider. You know, just the, the mechanics of the game. So I'm a huge fan of those type of games. It doesn't matter what system that it's on. If it's a game that I want to play, then I'm not gonna cry, bitch, and moan about <laughs> about you know uh, who to root for and. And you know about this whole entire bullshit about about why are you so happy about the other the competitors shit? You know why don't you just focus on your own shit? Like these type of people actually are corporate slaves. Like I never even heard of this guy. I never even heard of this guy. I believe he does have a YouTube channel, but I never heard of this guy. And that was just some uh, retardation that he was basically tweeting and shit. And this is basically what Phil Spencer is, is been saying about this. Uh, gaming community is very distasteful because these idiots out here that so more focus on the console wars than than focus on video games you know phil spencer basically turned the xbox around the xbox brand around you know <laughs> because don metro he, he basically kind of fucked it up and and he did a great job with this xbox and that's why i'm such a huge fan of phil spencer that's why i'm such a huge fan of my xbox one yes it's not it's not you know, powerful than the PS4, but it still holds its own. But at the end of the day, it's all about the games. It's all about the games, and I love and enjoy my games on my Xbox One. It's my preferred console of choice, but if there's games on other systems that I want to play, I'm going to get the games on the other system that I want to play and not concentrate on console wars because you know what? At the end of the day, I don't get paid shit from this console war shit. I don't get paid shit, so why should I bitch cry and moan about what system? <laughs> it's just, it's just so downright idiotic. But anyway, guys, y'all just give me y'all thoughts and y'all's opinions about this whole entire retardation once again in this Xbox community. Like they are so fucking pissed off about this whole entire, you know, I don't know. I guess some of these these people are still pissed off at Phil Spencer because some of these um. Xbox One exclusives is going on Windows 10, so they are still butt hurt and salty about that. 
and you know, right now a lot of them just won't um, fill Spencer's head. <laughs> just being honest, <laughs> this guy, this is a this dude right here is a nice guy, and a lot of these folks is just turned against him because because they 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 believe they don't got no ammunition to uh, basically shoot at the Sony fanboys. So I don't know, it's just dumb. I, I don't I don't want no part of that console war shit. I enjoy my Xbox. I love it. I have a shitload of games to play, and I'm not gonna bitch, cry, and moan about it. But y'all just give me y'all thoughts and y'all opinions about this bullshit. Like, comment, subscribe to my channel. And once again, it's your boy, Regan27. Yeah, have a good day.